everyone welcome back to my channel with my shady world in this video i will show you how we can have our top and records from a multiple dimension so let's get started here i have taken sample super store and in that the order sheet these are the column names that I have within this ordered sheet and in this I want to have this top and subcategory for the category. So category and subcategory both are the dimensions and combining or considering both of these condition, I want to have the top and records of this for individual on the category level as well. So let's see this uh, to give a user the flexibility to select the what are the top n records that they want, whether they are 5, 2, 10, 20 and so on so to give such user flexibility we need to create a parameter so let's first create a parameter let's say uh, right click anywhere out here and uh, in this in this measured area and uh, create a parameter and i will give it a name as n so which are that n that we need to select and change this data type to integer and the allowable values has to be in range something a minimum value has to be 2 and the max should range from this to let's say 40 okay so now as we, have, we can see we have created this parameter in this downward arrow click over here and make it enable the show parameter so now you have the slider of uh, adding the values in it whether you how much top end records that we need here so now well, uh, here to get this category and subcategory i will take the category to the rows and the subcategory as well to the rows and i will also want to take this category to the filter and let it on apply okay and uh, in this again on the downward uh, arrow click on show filter so now you can see that we have it all these now to in this abc uh, placeholder i want to place something as in quantities so let's say these are the quantities and i first let's sort this out and we can have this individual that in furniture furnishing chairs are the top two of them which are uh, highest uh, quantity or highest sales has been done in the furniture in the office uh, supplies there are the binders and the papers which are high on demand and have been uh, largely ordered similarly in technology they are the phones and the accessories so we want to have all this but for this, we need to create a specific thing that calculate this based on the top end. So that is, we should give it a rank for all the, all of these. So let's go on analysis, create a calculated field and in that give it a name as in rank order. And here I will write rank unique rank unique because we want to give a unique number even though if the quantities are being same for two um, different categories then as well so here in the expression what i will write is sum of within that parenthesis i will mention here the fixed because we need to consider uh, two of those fields which are like subcategory and the category so first we'll write category comma in that with the subcategory and after that we'll write colon so anything with that we will count the quantities once you do so at the end of this uh, rank unique uh, we want after that we also need to uh, give it a message of whether it should be an ascending or descending and what ways we want to have this unique values as we want to have a top end records we will go with the descending otherwise if we want to find out the bottom end records then we will go with the ascending so here in the quotes we will write descending and after this parenthesis whatever the value is it has to be 
less than the top n which not top n the n that we have created this parameter has to be less than that and now apply ok and then ok now this rank order drag it to the filter and make sure the condition has to be set true that if this condition that we have mentioned is correct then show those records so as for this if we say that for all the categories and i want uh, the furniture supplies and technologies and these are the two of those offices which are highest in demand if say if i just want only between the offices and technology then also the offices comes up let's say if i remove and make it just a technology so which are those two from the technology and so these are these two Similarly, if we say for the furniture as well, then between furniture and technology, one for the furniture, another for from technology, which are giving the top two. So point is, if you select whatever the categories are, so based on that, you can have your top end records, whether this from this category or this category it does not matter. The matter is based on the measure that you have inputted here, you will get uh, the rank orders on that and which are the rank orders being match with it, it will give you the exact match. Okay, so I hope you uh, understand this, uh, how to get the top and subcategory for a category or we can say the top and records for the um, multi dimension. So this is how we can simply create by using the parameter and the LOD uh, calculation here. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video.